Saltwater crocodiles, also known as salties, are the largest living reptiles on Earth. They can grow up to 23 feet in length and weigh over 2,000 pounds. These apex predators are found in brackish and saltwater habitats across Southeast Asia, Northern Australia, and the eastern coast of India. Their ability to live in both freshwater and marine environments gives them a distinct advantage over many other species. To understand why saltwater crocodiles have been so successful, we need to look at their evolutionary history. These reptiles belong to the order Crocodilia, which first appeared about 95 million years ago during the late Cretaceous period. This group includes all modern crocodiles, alligators, caimans, and gharials. Their ancestors coexisted with dinosaurs and survived the mass extinction event that wiped out the non-avian dinosaurs around 66 million years ago. One of the key factors contributing to the saltwater crocodile's success is its highly adaptable physiology. These reptiles have a four-chambered heart, similar to birds and mammals, which allows for efficient oxygenation of blood. This is crucial for their ability to stay submerged for long periods while hunting. They can hold their breath for up to an hour, a skill that is particularly useful when ambushing prey. Another remarkable adaptation is their powerful jaws and conical teeth, designed to grip and crush rather than slice. This allows saltwater crocodiles to tackle a wide range of prey, from fish and birds to large mammals, including water buffalo and even sharks. Their bite force is among the strongest of any animal, estimated to be around 3,700 pounds per square inch. Saltwater crocodiles also possess a highly developed sense of hearing and vision, which is essential for detecting prey. Their eyes are positioned on the top of their heads, allowing them to see above the water while the rest of their body remains submerged. This stealthy approach makes them efficient ambush predators, capable of launching a surprise attack with lightning speed. One of the most fascinating aspects of saltwater crocodiles is their complex social behavior. Contrary to popular belief, these reptiles are not solitary creatures. They exhibit a range of social interactions, including territorial disputes, courtship rituals, and parental care. Dominant males establish and defend territories that can span several square miles, while females build nests and fiercely protect their young from predators. Speaking of reproduction, saltwater crocodiles have a unique nesting strategy that has contributed to their survival. Females lay between 40 and 60 eggs in a mound of vegetation and mud, which acts as an incubator. The decomposition of plant material generates heat, maintaining the optimal temperature for egg development. Interestingly, the temperature within the nest determines the sex of the hatchlings. Warmer temperatures produce more males, while cooler temperatures result in more females. After an incubation period of about 90 days, the hatchlings emerge and make their way to the water. The mother often assists by gently carrying them in her mouth. This early care is crucial for the survival of the young crocodiles, as they are vulnerable to predation by birds, fish, and other crocodiles. The diet of saltwater crocodiles is another factor that has contributed to their dominance. They are opportunistic feeders, meaning they will eat almost anything they can catch. This includes fish, crustaceans, birds, mammals, and even carrion. Their ability to consume a wide variety of prey items ensures they can survive in different environments and conditions. One of the most impressive hunting techniques employed by saltwater crocodiles is the death roll. This maneuver involves the crocodile grabbing its prey and rapidly spinning its body to tear off chunks of flesh. The death roll is particularly effective against large prey that cannot be swallowed whole. This technique, combined with their ambush hunting strategy, makes them formidable predators in both aquatic and terrestrial environments. Saltwater crocodiles also have an extraordinary ability to regulate their salt intake, which allows them to thrive in marine environments. They possess specialized salt glands located on their tongues that excrete excess salt. This adaptation is essential for their survival in brackish and saltwater habitats, where freshwater sources may be scarce. In conclusion, the dominance of saltwater crocodiles since the time of the dinosaurs can be attributed to their unique adaptations, versatile hunting strategies, complex social behaviors, and remarkable resilience. These ancient reptiles are a testament to the power of evolution and the intricate balance of ecosystems. By understanding and appreciating their role in the natural world, we can work towards a future where saltwater crocodiles continue to reign as apex predators in their habitats.